Does Thai food use MSG? Thai food is some of the best tasting food in the world. As if that weren't enough, it's also very inexpensive. This means it has become a staple for many in the West, let alone the obvious popularity in Thailand itself. And this brings up the big question. Do they use MSG? And if so, is that the reason it tastes so good? If you're in Thailand, odds are high that whatever you're eating has MSG in it. If you're at a Thai food restaurant in America, well, that's probably the case as well, but it does depend. In Thailand, MSG is an important part of the flavor. So much so that most restaurants and street vendors wouldn't dream of cutting it out of the menu. The thing is, Thais are very particular about the taste of their food, and cooks claim that using no MSG would mean no customers. Even if you request no MSG, most Thai flavorings have MSG in them. Although they are not directly adding it to the meal, the soy sauce, fish sauce, bouillon, those all have MSG. So yes, it's extremely difficult to entirely avoid MSG in Thai food. Before you swear off Thai food, it's important to know that this is not unique to their cuisine. Most of us are aware of the heavy use of MSG in Chinese food, but many are oblivious to the other common foods that use it heavily. Ever wonder why Doritos taste so good? Yep, MSG. Along with Cheetos, Pringles, and many other chips. We all know that KFC fried chicken is not exactly healthy, but most never guess it's also high in MSG. How about that Chick-fil-A sandwich? Guilty as well. Okay, but those are all junk food, we know that. What about the Campbell's chicken noodle soup? You know, the one mom gives you when you're sick? Yep, MSG. Hidden Valley Ranch dressing. The one you put on your nice green salad that, you know, you're eating for health reasons? That has MSG. A few other things, seaweed salad, Parmesan cheese, gravy mixes, Protein powders. A lot of us are guilty of having one of these as a lunch substitute. Pepperoni in our pizzas. Ever wonder why the bagged popcorn tastes better than the popcorn you make yourself in butter and salt? Well, their flavoring usually has MSG, not salt. And no, these things are not labeled as MSG in the ingredients. It'll be something like Flavor Enhancer 621 or any number of other references. There's so many names, we could go on for hours. The point here, you've been consuming a lot more MSG than you are aware of. And in moderation, it's probably not a big deal. So if you make some effort to limit MSG in your Thai food, and you're consuming a fair amount of vegetables and such without sauces, you could probably eat Thai food every day without having any problem. Just be aware, yes, it does normally have MSD, so do a lot of other foods. Thanks.